Now we're gonna check out this guy. I've been invited to three sex parties tonight. And I know you're thinking there's no way that I'm gonna attend all three, to which I say, think again. I am all about breaking records and being of service to my community. One's at 5 p.m. and I'm almost there. Then the next one has a hard cut off at seven and that's in Midtown, so I gotta get there. The third one's at 9.30, also in Midtown, so this is very manageable. I have snacks, I have breath mints, I have long socks so I can stick a bottle of lube in them at clothes check if I need to. I am ready and prepared to make history. Okay, I'm here, I gotta go. Party number one, big success. <laughs> understand i'm trying to be more realistic and set my expectations these days and quit while i'm ahead because i'll just be going at it with these guys and then i'll look up and be like oh my god i'm in love with six of you and does that work out well for me in the end okay some context this is a gay guy and uh... oh really <laughs> <laughs> and he's going empty man thinks you're enjoying this i am listen he's going to three different sex parties in one night Allegedly. Allegedly. People need to stop lying on the internet, man. <laughs> Nobody's inviting this nigga to a set goddamn sex party. But I think he's Nobody paying for it. This motherfucking old I think... mo what? <laughs> I think he's paying for it. He's paying. He's this paying. nigga looks like the boss off the Incredibles, nigga, <laughs> with the long fucking hair. Nobody wants that fucking weird beak face at their fucking sex party. Are you serious? <laughs> Oh, okay, that's good to do. Stop lying. Once. I'm trying to fall in love with less people, right? And I thought that I was doing a great job, and I was like, you know what? Only in love with four. I've had a great down, time. See, time they to get out and go. Second, a big ass forehead, almost hitting them. You second eight dick, and you almost hitting them in the goddamn <laughs> forehead with that big ass thing. Uh, yeah. Go ahead, man. Yeah. The next one. And then the really hot one was like, <laughs> "Hey, don't leave before I get your number." And I was like, <laughs> "Anyway, I gave it to him. Hey, don't get your hopes up. You and me both." The night is still young, though. There's so many other people I can fall in love with. He's wearing his like an hour thing. later, and I just left number two. Um, not as good as number one. The first one was at somebody's apartment, so very friends vibes. And the one I just left was at like a sanctioned place in Midtown. There was a cover charge for this one too, which I didn't pay because they said I looked under 25. <laughs> Both were diverse and inclusive groups in terms of like demographic, but not in terms of mindset. Like at the first one, everyone is into everybody and like playing with everybody. And then at the second one, it was kind of like everyone's walking around, like scoping each other out. And I'm like, you didn't pay $30 to scope people out. Like what, let's do stuff. <laughs> I still had my fair share of fun, but different environments, just different experience. I have enough time to get pizza before party number three. And that's what I'm doing. I also- uh -huh. Bitch, you look like you motherfucking 45, nigga. Didn't nobody fucking confuse you, confuse you for no goddamn 25, nigga. You look like fucking Caitlyn Jenner before the surgery, nigga. The fuck are you talking about with no fucking makeup on, you ugly asshole? Talking about who you gonna put? Shut up. The reason why they're looking at you weird walking around because they you're ugly. That's why they weren't being weird. They didn't want to fucking touch you if you really were even in there. Oh, why everybody all standoffish? Because you're fucking hideous. They're, they're trying to figure out what the fuck they're looking at. Is that a fucking scream mask? Are you wearing a goddamn scream mask right now? Are you in a horror movie? What the fuck am I looking at? <laughs> Relax, Ross. Learn how to make a video with some goddamn perspective and put some fucking buildings in the background. Yeah. You're in New York walking around making a video. You're not even giving us nothing to look at. We're going to look at your motherfucking screwed snowman face the whole time. You look like a fucking pale <laughs> old snowman that somebody left outside and then fucking pissed on. Yeah. All right, go ahead. What I what I wanted to you say. You put this on. I don't know why you fuck you. Why? Why, yeah. why would you put this on? I'm gonna say why. Uh, why? Why? I put I'm gonna this start on. roasting you in a minute. <laughs> go ahead. My why I put this on is because to raise this question. You want to raise awareness, right? No. Why are somebody find him and bring him to me? Why are... find this man? I need this man no, in my no, house no, now. No, no, no. That's no. why you want to play Why this are gay people so into sex all the time? Is that all you are? Are you serious? You really yeah. don't know why? Yeah. You really don't know why? I mean, listen. The same reason why hoes are into sex so much. Because that's the only time they feel connected to somebody. Because nobody... Dude, don't get me into this, all right? Well, I'm just this saying... This is not even a real video. Is that a, you think he you think he got invited to three sex parties? Hell even, no. Even if he hasn't. Nobody invited him to a fucking sex party. Even if he hasn't. I'm just saying. Nobody invited every time, him to a sex party. Every time I see a gay person, all they talk about is sex. I mean, is there no more depth 
it's, it's, they're just like hoes. That's why. Yeah, but it's so hoes, shallow. They're male hoes. Yeah. They're male. Think about it. They're men. All we think about, not all, but we think about sex way more than women. And they're the they're the gay version of that. They I think know. extra think about sex. I yes. know, but it's like. Look, man, their, uh, their life is hard enough, all right? I know, but just it's like, come them. on, man. It, 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 you know, show something How more. How do you even see this? I'm, ju I'm just saying, show something more. Do you follow this nigga? Let me find out you follow this nigga. No, I found it on Twitter, man. On my timeline. I'm just saying. Show... Somebody put a poll up. Does Shit. Vince follow this guy and that's how he found him or not? <laughs> I'll just say, show something more than sex. It's getting, you know, it's getting uh, shallow. You know what I mean? Shallow. That's all I want to say. It's too shallow for your gay taste. Your gay taste <laughs> is less shallow. You like you're less shallow gay. This is not the type of gay Vince likes. No, Vince just... likes... Deeper gay, more introspective gay. I right, just, that, that's how that's how Vince likes his I'm men. I'm just saying they come across very uh, perverted. You know what I mean? You come across very perverted. <laughs> I'm just you saying. do. I'm just saying. I'm just dude. If I was scrolling on this on Twitter, I would I would click off it in two <laughs> seconds. I'm I, less than two seconds. As soon as I heard the voice, guess what? I got it. Loot, not me. It's not for me. <laughs> it's not for me. All I right. would never see this. All right. This this is obviously for you though. Let's Gay finish people. the video. Go ahead. No, no, I want to hear how the story ended. Uh, oh, no, 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 okay. no. You got okay. it. No, let's okay. hear how it ended. I know some of you are let's like, hear... you cannot oh, yeah. waterboard this information out of me, James. Why are you telling us this? Partially because I am a consenting adult and this is a normal thing that some people do. And I think there's a lot of shame and stigma where there doesn't need to be about enjoying these kind of events. There are also tons of people who think trans and non-binary people like me are not attractive and will never find love or that we're like sterile. There's so many misconceptions. Uh, after getting dicked down by half of New York, I'm here to tell you that we are very desirable and we are very hot to many people and like you can be trans and non-binary and still okay, have a healthy right, wonderful right, stop, stop. Right. I, thought, I thought he was gonna keep talking about the other sex stuff listen listen why i don't know why you did that to us vince uh, i just wanted What's to raise you, vince? i just wanted to raise the question hey gay people i just wanted to raise yeah hey gay people if you want to be seen as more than sex show it Show something else. They don't want to be seen as more than that. Well, they then... want to have sex with you, Vince. <laughs> <laughs> All right? Do you not get it? Do you not get it? They don't want to be seen. They want to They want to fuck you, okay? okay. So just leave them alone. Right. Stay away from them. Don't engage. Right. It's like it's like a bear. Treat it like a bear attack. All right? Don't <laughs> engage. All right? You just act like it's not even there. Let them do right. their thing and you do your thing. I, I tried to help them out there. You know, show something more than sex. Look, look. Yeah. All right, well, if you want to help them out, then go yeah. find them and then tell them in person <laughs> since you obviously want to talk to them so damn bad. All right. What do you guys think? Put it in the comment section what you guys think about this. Also, if you have suggestions, put it in the comment section. Okay.